I think when people think of Afghanistan, they just think of war or terrorism or extremism. And you'd be surprised at how beautiful of a country it is. From the first time that I landed there, I was just amazed. In the fall of 2001, I was based in Tokyo for the Christian Science Monitor, and I was a bureau chief covering Japan and Southeast Asia. I was actually working on an assignment uh, about trafficking of women in Asia when 9-11 happened. At the time, the newspaper wanted me to um, sort of set aside all of the, the Asia reporting that I was doing. So after doing you know, some travels around the Middle East about the story, my editor sometime around uh, after September 11th, it must have been close to Thanksgiving, said, we'd like you to go. For the first time in my life as a reporter, I'd probably been working then for about eight years in journalism, I said, let me think about it for a day. And I came to the conclusion that, um, that it was possible to do it, that it was risky but not insane. Some mix of feeling a call to duty that's different than a soldier's call to duty, but I think it's a calling nonetheless that says this is a moment in history. It involves my country, it involves my government, it's going to involve um, average people, men and women, who are the soldiers who are putting their lives on the line for this mission. And if I can be there to tell part of that tale and to bear witness to what's happening, I think that's one of the most meaningful things I could do with my life.